astute viewers might notice that this is not actually the place where I usually make my videos. I've been kicked out of the last joint. Uh, why? Whoa! Craigslist is awesome! I'm kind of hoping to tie a, tie a bow on, on Germany and call it done now. So a couple of weeks ago I went out to a social coding workshop. I was hosting that for, it's an open tech school course, introducing people to the wonders of social coding and using GitHub and sharing code online and how to interact with other programmers via the internet. It was a lot of fun. And it was surprisingly uh, quite straightforward to teach people how to use Git, which is often thought of as a very difficult tool. But if you teach it or introduce it to someone in the right way, it can actually be fairly straightforward for 90% of what you want to do with it. So that worked out really well. Uh, on the OTS Beginners Meetup, I did a presentation about my life as a programmer and how, oh my god, isn't it so awesome, hey, can be a programmer, la di da di da I just, uh, I thought it would be good to give uh, a talk about the, the life of a programmer rather than some technical talk about this is language X or this is how databases work or all that sort of stuff because I think it's important to to put human stories out there and um, seeing as there weren't many around I just decided to put one out myself and it went quite well uh, I got a few comments from people saying yes they found it very interesting I felt that I was really rusty because I haven't really done much presentation before besides the hours of unreleased camera footage that's never coming out and most of it's already been deleted but it was it was fun and I got to do what most programmers do when they give a talk which is play around with presentation software for five hours and then spend 20 minutes making up a talk uh, I hope to uh, I hope to do some more in future I think it's I think it could be quite a lot of fun to to bring that concept of more than just a, a dry talk about tool or or, or technology just to just to round off uh, meetup groups and things like that and to make them a little bit more personal if you're wondering about YouTubery and YouTube shows I've learned a lot and I've done uh, a lot of experimenting lighting uh, composition like framing and stuff like that but also like screen casting screen capture uh, content and the pacing of content uh, presentation skills and all that sort of stuff uh, and I don't think I'm really there yet actually to to be able to put something out I think what you what I really need right now is a location um, yeah <laughs> I don't have anywhere to live on a on a permanent basis and I can't that means I can't fix things like this flickering light that happens every now and then and I need time to actually like commit you know it's not a matter of like putting in thousands like of, of hours a week or whatever it's just about putting in like a steady amount of time you know just that like that one hour a day or like or like eight hours a week of just being able to say work on a show work on a show work on a show and, and to be able to put something out consistently and I, I just can't do that right now because my life is a little bit topsy-turvy well, uh, Saturday week, I'll be on a train to Frankfurt and I'll spend a couple of days there and then I'm packing up the bike and taking it with me on an aeroplane back to Australia. So I'll be in Oz on December 5th. Uh, there is a few weeks of catching up with people in Melbourne uh, and I'm booked out for Christmas and New Year's, but yeah, I'm hoping to catch up with, with everyone back in the land down under. It's going to be such a relief to get back home. It's going to be awesome. I'll catch you guys next time. Ciao.